Hello, Sunpower here. And we need to talk because of something that happened last night. You know, thank goodness I'm giving Pine Power and I all my support, and he's giving me hearts on my comments, meaning like. Mm -hmm. But we need to talk about, like, what's going on in Long Island, the discrimination of not letting him live in a place like Rockville Center in Lindbrook. By the way, he doesn't want to live east of Freeport, though, because of the lack of bus service. But I just want the best for Pine Power Alliance. I want him to find an apartment in Rockville Center. I've, with my business and my CEO powers, I can earn enough money to buy him an apartment. But then I have to actually, I do want, I'm okay with doing this, but, but it's a risk because of what if my business stops earning money? And that is paying for his utilities, which is something I'm willing to do. <laughs> but I don't think that'll be a problem. Because, you know, without without a rental, you need to pay for utilities. If it's a, buy, a bought apartment or house. But I'm sure that's going to be okay. And you people from the South Shore, if you don't like Pine Power, I live in the community because of me. Live with it. Because he's has every right to. Anyway. Another thing about how he likes the Pine Barrens is how another plan on how he could live in a great place with Pine Barrens. Basically, his Pine Barrens are what I have a similar thing in my life, mentally. I'll talk to you about in a later video. Will be brought up later in this video. But... Thank goodness what I got, I already got, because my mom saved my life 21 years ago by giving me this. <laughs> I don't, you're probably wondering what that is. Just wait for the next video, and I've already talked about this topic on YouTube. But since Pine Power Line has to live within, like, 5, 10, mil 10 miles of Pine Barrens, this is why I was thinking if, you, if we found him, if he got support, I wouldn't even have to help him find an apartment if it was in White Plains. But... <laughs> In White Plains, and if you plant the Pine Barrens on the Sawmill River, like I planned on developing there, along the Hutchinson Air Parkway area, where you'd find future TTT trains, and then the uh, Route 25 buses are a short walk from there on the V-Line bus, mm -hmm. and future, fu future buses on the TTT as well. My company, which is going to compete with the uh, N16, N40, and N41 buses. <laughs> anyway, built, planting pine barrens could draw pine parallel out of Westchester in better living conditions. Also, more fair government. And this is actually, and it's not the entire New York state actually that is neglected, it's just Long Island. Just the center part of North, of Long Island between Floral Park and Hicksville. That's it. Maybe some other places too, along the North Shore and on the Rotten Conkoma, Port Jefferson, and along 495, 495 the Long Island Expressway. But that's it. Westchester is not being neglected, as you can see here. I mean, this hill is natural. I know I hate the hill, but <laughs> this hill is something that wasn't caused by the government. It was caused by the Earth's geological and continental drift movements. Something else that Pine Power Line is very into is the geology. <laughs> anyway, we have the we have the mini oil train here. We're about to get into Old Country Road. <laughs> Leaving Garden City. Hello, mini oil. <laughs> and I need to pause the video here to get out my mask. Back on Old Country Road, or Columbus Avenue as it's really called. <laughs> we push this conveniently placed walk signal here in Mineola. Technically it's Garden City. The other, the other side of the street is Mineola. But in actuality it's all Tuckahoe. <laughs> I think from now, from now there might be a wrong punk of the train coming in and stop making its first stop here at Mineola or Crestwood. Is that our Ronkonkoma train? Probably is, that's it. I think it's our Ronkonkoma train. Looks like it's a... Oh my god, is that an M3? 
Today's Sunday. Sunday. Mm -hmm. And we have an M3. Or no, it's an M7. Anyway, that train originates here at Manila. And it stops at Maryland Avenue, um, New Hyde Park, Floral Park, Queens Village, Hollis, Jama Jamaica, Kew Gardens, Forest Hills, Woodside, and then a few other stops that lead into the actual alternative names. Leading into Manhattan via Harlem and Street and Grand Central. Hicksville train. Anyway, I was talking about flying power line. Now white plains, if there were pine if I could plant pine barrens and white plain in the Solomon River area and you could take the you can take the number five bus on the V line. Next station Coral Place. Actually it's really Scarsdale. Can't show them on the camera. I'm actually going to the lottery shop. Get my my sweet sweet mom some Cheetos. Okay. Actually there's no Ron Conkama trains here. Just Hicksville mm -hmm. and Mineola. Mm -hmm. No southeast trains. Oh, what's this train doing? Do we have problems in here in Mineola? Just like how there's problems in the real Mineola. Mm -hmm. I think we're waiting for the another train to pass because we have single tracking up ahead. I don't know why I'm rail fanning here. I should be talking about the situation that Pine Power is having. What I like to say, what I would think it would be called is like he had half of a nervous breakdown the other day because of the weekend service. I mean, hopefully he'll be able to do what he wants to do on weekends and rent a small, like low-end motel room. I think that's what he can afford on the weekends in Rockville Center is a motel room, not a hotel room, until this problem is solved. But I'm here for you. I'm gonna use the earnings I have to get you what you need. One of my other jobs is gonna be advocating, but I'm not sure if it can be a job, per se, because I have the same problems. Pine Power Ally, I can't work. <laughs> okay, we didn't have to wait for a train. Besides, it's Hartsdale or Westbury that you need to wait <laughs> for single tracking. Bye bye, Hicksville. One part about like the Pine Barrens though is it can't be just like props or anything, it has to be planted in a legitimate way. Because for me, the clip on earrings, necklaces, they just don't like that's what my Pine Barrens really are. They don't work. You have to you have to have like what I what I do have, and you know if Pine Barrel is in the situation, he'd be doomed. He's forty six and he doesn't have them. But thank goodness for him, it's Pine Barrens and not ear piercings. Sorry if I was like making a comparison there. That was kind of scary. But John, I'm in for you. Hope you do well. And, and come soon, you'll be able to ride the TTT bus. Even though the GMC RTSs are 25 years older than the, than the nice buses, they're still in way better shape and work much better. That's why they cost 4,000 a piece and not 400, like they usually would. Bye.